Hey guys, it's me, Ipinoy Phone. Tonight, I will review two awesome apps that I found on Cydia. Both of these apps are theming apps. If you like to play around with the look of your iPhone, then these apps are for you. So the first one is called Dreamboard. Let's open it up. So the first image you see is the default theme. That's the theme you are on right now. Right now, I only have two HTC themes. This one is just a plain one, while the second one has the Facebook and Twitter widgets. Just tap it and choose apply, and it will load the theme for you. And that's it. It looks very similar to the ones you see on HTC phones. You have application shortcuts on the springboard. What's cool about this is that there's a live animated weather on the screen. Just press the information button on the top right corner to enter your zip code. I don't know if you can see the rays here on the top right. Right now, our weather here is fair. If it's raining where you are, the screen will also show a rain animation. If it's cloudy, clouds will appear on the screen. It's very cool. Very similar to the ones on HTC phones. On the bottom right corner is the on and off switch for the animation and on the bottom left corner is the application button. Here you will see all the apps that you have on your iPhone. Next, if you scroll to the left, you have the interactive Facebook widget. You can pretty much do everything that you can do on the actual Facebook app. Scroll to the right, you will see the live clock widget and some more application shortcuts. Scroll to the right one more time. Here you have the Twitter widget. This is basically similar to the mobile version of Twitter. So yeah, this is a really unique theme for the iPhone. If you get bored to the grid style setup of the iPhone, just jailbreak your device and download this app. Now, to go back to your old theme, just load the Dreamboard app again. Then scroll back to the leftmost theme, which is your default theme, and tap it. And it will take you back to your old theme. It switches between themes very fast. It's really convenient. You don't have to spend so many hours setting or arranging your icons. The only downside is Dreamboard eats up a lot of your phone's memory. The next app that I want to share with you is the Backboard app. So let's go ahead and load this app. Here you have all the themes. Let's choose the OS 7 theme. Press install, then confirm. Unlike Dreamboard, this app takes longer to change themes. So let's just wait while it loads. Okay, click respring and let's wait again. Okay, it's downloading the OS 7 theme, and here it is. It looks very similar to the ones you see on a Windows phone. It has all the live tiles, which animates very smoothly. I did not experience any lag so far. We also have a nice animation on the Facebook tile. Press the arrow button to reveal all the apps you have on your iPhone. I don't like this at all because you have to scroll down to get to the app that you like to load. But anyway, you have the option to bring all your favorite apps on the first page, which I will show later. By the way, I changed the photos on the Facebook tile with the photos of my friends. You can also do that on the Photos app. Now, let's go ahead and try putting some apps on the first page. Let's say you want the Angry Birds on the first page. Just press and hold it, then choose Pin to the Start menu. And there it is. If you want to remove this, just press and hold on it again, then choose and pin. And that's it. Let's try it one more time. This time, let's choose the Apple Store app. Press and hold, then pin to the Start menu. And there's the Apple Store app. You can also move the tiles up or down. To return to your default theme, just load the backboard app again. Then choose the default theme, click on install, then confirm. Again, let's wait for it to load. This is the only bad thing I observe. 
it takes time to switch between teams. Now let's click Respring. And that's it. Let's unlock this. And you're back to your old team. So these two apps are available in Cydia. I do recommend it to everyone. With Dreamboard and Backboard on your iPhone, you get the best of not only two, but three operating systems. That is Apple, HTC, and Windows. So that's it for me. Thanks for watching and I'll see you guys next time. Bye.